I don't think I wanted to. And there she is in the hallway, gonna rip my face off. Happy Halloween, ghouls and goblins. I am the Scarecrow. Let's get back to our playthrough of Infliction. Pleasant Falls. Yeah, it doesn't seem fucking pleasant to me. I hear an ice cream thing. Oh, what do we got? Officer Kerry Mills badge. Oh, I see. That's so we can get into the other rooms. Okay. What's this? We recently received sp uh, several reports of a man wearing a top hat lurking in the woods. The locals have reported this man R as an investigation okay, has gone into the tragic death. The locals have reported this man as trustworthy and upstanding citizen. The reason this comes up because each report places him around 12 feet tall with glowing red eyes and no face. Obviously, this presents a significant problem for our sketch artists. Really? That's what you're concerned about? The strange thing with these reports isn't the odd nature of the report, but the condition of the site where he was spotted. After an investigating site, the foliage in the area has been frozen solid and shattered. Oh, Jack Frost, eh? Every, every blade of grass, or uh, even blades of grass are now tiny shards. I don't know if what these people are seeing is real, but they're seeing something unusual and it's causing some very strange phenomena. The local paper has taken to calling the entity the Icy Hatter, and the town is intrigued. It has town intrigued. The only concern for the safety of our people. Until I know this situation, uh, this thing is not a threat, I'll need to respond to all sightings in a timely fashion. So what the fuck? If any of this is to be taken at face value, No, I don't want to take the other. What have we here? So if any of this is to be taken at face value, right? They, uh, there's a whole lot of creepy ass bullshit going on. What do we got? Oh, another piece of her photo, huh? Third floor butchery? in there. Uh oh. One of these things is gonna fucking fly through the window and smash me in the face. Oh fuck. Or oh, she's gonna fly through the window. Mantle? I'm dead? So, okay, wait a minute. I know I keep, like, I'm dead, this is only the beginning. I know I keep, uh, like, interrupting my senses, but there's a lot of creepy-ass fucking bullshit going on here. So we got some creepy-ass stranger in the middle of the woods, supposedly. So, what the hell? We have three suspects. It can't be the dad, because he was out getting ice cream with his daughter and has an alibi. Which, by the way, let me get on with that. The daughter was six at the time of the kid's death. So... Oh, Jesus, I can't see fucking shit. It's even dark. So... It's supposedly she was 19 at the beginning of this fucking story. Okay, can we get a snap a picture of the toilet see what happens with that? So, 13 years since the kid was murdered, or whatever the hell, right? 13 fucking years of what the hell happening? Oh, I don't think I was actually able to go into this bathroom before. This doesn't look familiar. But who knows, the house keeps changing, so... I need to find more... Nope, that's not what I wanted. 
more of her pictures. Photo pieces. There's at least one more. Okay. Yeah, see look, this is the this is the bedroom of a fucking six year old. With steps that go up to the bed and everything. Postpartum depression. Damn. I never I've never heard of postpartum depression making you summon fucking demons and shit. So yeah, there's certainly more to this fucking story. Here we are back in the office. It sure would be nice to be able to fucking see. Ah oh, yes, and the painting has changed once again. With blood all over it. Blood? Blood! Alright, fuck. What the hell do I do now? I don't think I wanted to... And there she is in the hallway, gonna rip my face off. Uh oh, somebody's upset. Oh yeah, I found, oh, what do we got? He's gone, but I still hear him. He's trying to talk, but it's faded, muted, and jumbled. What does it mean? It means you fucking lost your goddamn mind, is what it means. You fucking batshit crazy is what the hell's going on. So, I'm not sure the, uh... The husband is to fucking blame entirely all in us. There's something fucking something doesn't jive. Can I head under the bed? I can. But to what end? Jesus, is this fucking thing? Jesus, I, I, you know what, I take it back, I was complaining about the, I was complaining about the fucking flashlight before, Jesus, now it's really bad. I don't understand though, so, I mean, he must have done something to her, why else is she pissed at him? Unless she blames him too, but he was at the fucking store. Oh, there she is. Ah, fuck. Oh, oh Jesus, a picture of the Grim Reaper standing near a crib. That's not fucked up at all. Someone hanging from the chandelier or some shit. Oh, here we go. There's the rest of the photo, you fuckers. Alright, now she's gonna get pissed off and come get me. She 
indicates light. Okay. So does that mean she won't come in here? Nice horned mask on the wall. Jesus. Oh, really? Oh, fucking smash. Oh, damn. 